What's up, it's Brendan, and I'm gonna show you how to use full frames with Hooker. All you gotta do is find the scene you wanna use right here. We're gonna use this scene when she spot a turn, and then we're gonna stop right here because the movement ends right there. And now what we gotta do is cut every time your frame moves. So to make it easier, use page up and down to go frame by frame. So now that we have our frames cut up, like the bottom clip, we we'll shift and select the top clip, and just drag it all the way to the left. Like so, then right click, keep from assistant, you can layers, press OK. And once we're done with that, just pre compose it to these settings. Okay. And we're just gonna render it and put it into a folder. So now that we're done with that, open up full frames, go to interpolation, browse video, and then click on your video. Make sure that this is set to times eight and press interpolate. Okay, now once you're done rendering, just drag in your flow frames clip into a and let's create a new composition and drag in our flow frame clip. So let's make this like that long. So we're gonna pre-compose it with these settings. Press OK. Add Twixer Pro. And then whatever FPS your clip is in, mine is in 191.808. You're gonna put that as your input frame rate. So 191.8. And then for all these other settings, it's contrast edge enhance, motion wave blend, and or click a clip and press OK. Then control Alt to timer map. So we're gonna bring this last keyframe all the way here. If it's warping at the end, drag your numbers right here to the left slightly so it stops warping. Like that. We're gonna F9 it and go to our graph and make a graph like this. And uh, this is what we have so far. Thank you for watching and see ya.